And you're missing out. Really. You are missing out. Yeah. On the joy of life. Bing! <laughs> you wish you could just bing and then like bewitched. Basically what Amazon is, isn't it? Like us? No. Like us. <laughs> Please like us. We need more subscribers. <laughs>
because they were like, what is this? This was like quite a few years ago. And because everybody else had got really like thoughtful gifts. Yeah. And so when this person opened this, they were like, what? Like, this is horrible. And so I explained to them, I was like, well, you're working at the desk all the time. You can't always get back to the microwave to like warm up your coffee or whatever. And then everybody was like, oh, that's really <laughs> thoughtful. <laughs> but at first people were like, oh, that's kind of a bum gift, you know? Like, it, Really? Yeah. It was weird. A milk frother. It'll set you back about $17 on Amazon, but it comes in 18 bajillion colors. So you can pick whichever one you think your friend or family member would like the best. I have one of these. Um, I bought it at the beginning of the pandemic because I was like bored and I wanted to try learning new things. <laughs> Apparently milk frothing was one of those things, but it works really well. You can also use it. James uses it like when he's making gravy and stuff. It's really good for agitating the gravy. So it's a multi-use product even. <laughs> Harry Potter clue. Yeah. This game will be about 50 bucks, but I did actually buy it for Michelle a long time ago and we have played it quite a few times over mm -hmm. the years. If you like Clue, you'll love this game. If you don't like Clue, but you like Harry Potter, you'll probably still like this game because it is a little bit different than Clue as well. Mm -hmm. A Bath and Body Works three wick candle. These candles are great. They are a little bit on the expensive side. They're like $26.95 mm -hmm. for a single candle. But if you wait till there's um, sales, you can get them for half price a lot of the time. Make sure you get a gift receipt when you buy this though, because not everybody has the same taste and smells. And the great thing about Bath and Body Works is that you can return anything. So if they don't like the scent that you picked them, that's okay. They can go back and get the one that they want. A Harry Potter coloring book. If you have an adult in your life who likes to color to relax, like Michelle, then you can get them a Harry Potter coloring book. I know that a lot of the things that I've got you are Harry Potter <laughs> over the years. I'm, I'm noticing a trend here. <laughs> it is great if you know somebody who likes to color to relax. They're very intricate designs and the pictures come out beautifully. They're on Amazon for about $22 now. Mm -hmm. David's Tea Sampler Set. It'll run you about 35 bucks, but you get at least 20 different types of tea. Mm -hmm. It's a huge box. So if you have someone in your life that loves tea... Get them a sampler set, and then maybe they can try different flavors they didn't even know David C had. A scarf. It'll run you about 16 bucks on Amazon. And it's one of those really big, chunkety, cute scarves. Keep you nice and warm in the winter. Or if you work in a chilly office, you can use it as like a wrap to keep you warm. You can't go wrong with um, a bottle of wine. Mm -hmm. What I like to do though is I like to keep my favorite bottle of wine on hand so that I can share it with other people. You never really know what other people's tastes are, but I think that there is some special meaning behind sharing something that's your favorite. So for me, that's a Jaylor Cabernet Sauvignon, in case anybody was wondering. I like red wine. Another great, quick, easy gift to have on hand is some chocolate covered spoons. We made these in our Christmas treats video, so we'll link that here for you. They're just great to have on hand. You can mix them in some milk to make some chocolate milk. You can mix them with some hot chocolate. You can use them for a variety of reasons and they're just a cute little treat to have on hand to hand out to people who are over at your house during the holiday season. A notebook is always a great gift. Um, on Amazon you can find different sizes, shapes, colors, run you anywhere from 10 to 20 bucks, depending on what you're looking for. A coffee mug. Who doesn't love a new coffee mug? I do. Because <laughs> it depends. Like, you don't know how much you want to drink, the <laughs> mood you're in, what you're drinking could also dictate what kind mm -hmm. of mug. Mm -hmm. You know, a black coffee isn't going to be the same as a latte mug. Or a tea mug. Yeah. Or maybe to you it is. Yeah. <laughs> but it's still a great gift. <laughs> On Amazon you can get them from anywhere from 10 to 20 bucks. If you've got any kids in your life that you need to get gifts for, we've got you covered there too. A gemstone dig kit. This runs about $30. I haven't purchased one of these specifically before, but I've purchased many of the things from the National Geographic range for different kids and everybody that I bought one for has loved it. 
So in this specific instance, you just sort of, you dig out the gems, you get all the tools to become an archeologist and dig out these different gems. And it's a really great gift that's not just, you know, a plastic thing that makes a lot of noise. It's something that the kids actually get to do. That's cool. Wood Marble Run 3D Puzzle. <laughs> now that, again, is a mouthful. Um, but it is, again, one of those things that kids can do as opposed to um, just watch or, you know, is, are passive with. So it's a 3D puzzle that's made out of wood, as the name implies, and you build it together and then it makes a marble run. They have lots of different things that you can do. I got my nephew... A few years ago I got him a trebuchet building kit and so like they're small they're yeah. not they're not huge Ugh. things but but you know he built a trebuchet and he had a lot of fun making that and he learned along the way so my teacher heart was happy these things can be a little bit expensive that they're around $50 mm -hmm. but it depends on which kit you purchase um, you can get them anywhere between 40 and 60 make a money tree this one does take a little bit of effort but it's more fun than just putting a couple of bills in a card and handing it off to the person that you're giving a gift to. Um, we're going to link down below, uh, like a link to somebody's blog whose idea this was, but it's just a fun way to fold up the bills and put it all together so that it looks nice, but you're able to give the gift of money mm -hmm. without it just being, here, have some money. Yeah. <laughs> if you have a kid that likes to build things and likes Minecraft, Minecraft Lego. <laughs> <laughs> they've come up with so many cool like different types of sets now with mm -hmm. lego it's really fun to build together on amazon right now it's 19.98 for the kit a superhero costume set so it comes with five capes five masks and your kid and their friends or your, their cousins or whoever wants to play can play superheroes it's only 40 bucks yeah. Thanks so much for watching. Let us know down in the comments if you've ever purchased any of these things before or if and now you're planning on it for Christmas gifts this year. Make sure you like this video to let us know that this is the kind of content you want to keep on seeing and we would love it if you would subscribe so you didn't miss any of our videos. Thanks so much. Merry Christmas and happy holidays everyone. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And happy holidays. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas!